Her site is part of a Congresswoman Debbie Wasserman Schultz district. And last night she spoke to our Elliot Rodriguez about the federal response and the work being done at the site. Debbie Mayor uh, Daniela Levine Cava told me she got a phone call from President Biden and President Biden offered assistance and she requested FEMA. Realistically, what can FEMA do? So I have really good news. When I, uh, just before I left Washington and got on the plane, I was on the phone with the White House Chief of Staff, Ron Klain, told him about all of the things that FEMA, that we would need from FEMA, and they moved into, mobilized into action throughout the day. I've been working with, with FEMA and our local, uh, our state emergency management folks, and when the request goes up, which the governor has declared the, the, the emergency, the White House is, through FEMA, is prepared to offer any assistance that's necessary. So that means everything from, the, and I won't go into the technical names for them, but things like debris removal, emergency sheltering, making sure that the cities have their costs reimbursed for this unanticipated expense, and then critically, you know, assistance like funeral costs and, and longer term you know, housing assistance and the, the, the kind of thing that in a tragedy, and this is an unprecedented tragedy, we've just never seen anything like this in the country, the mobilization of the federal resources that will be sent down uh, is also unprecedented. It's just not been a, a, a tragedy like this, and the, pre the, the, the FEMA administrator approved this disaster relief verbally, and they, they, the White House has told me when the request comes up, the help will the help will be sent. Have you met those who are awaiting word about the missing people in there, and what can you tell them? Not only have I met with people who are awaiting word, but I've had calls from constituents and friends of mine who have family and friends in the building who are unaccounted for, and people's hearts have been torn out. They're they're praying and hoping beyond hope that 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 a miracle can be found. But we have the best search and rescue team in the country that we send all over the world. I've seen you report about their work. Um, that's who's on the ground now, making sure that they can do everything they can. The painstaking, aching process of trying to make sure that with a very unstable situation structurally, that they can do the work necessary to hopefully find anyone who they can pull out as a survivor.